Hello everyone. In this video, we'll go over how to create heat maps using Pandas library and the matplotlib library uh, using also using Python. Uh, so here's what a basic heat map looks like, uh, where you have uh, column values and row values, and you have different colors representing different values, where a higher value has a certain color code usually. Uh, in this case red and the lower the value gets the more of a green color it becomes whereas mid-range values are represented in yellow so these color schemas can change from uh, heat map to heat map but uh, the main focus of this video is how to create one using matplotlib uh, more specifically the pyplot submodule of matplotlib uh, so here's the documentation page uh, showing all the functions of this submodule. Uh, more specifically, we're going to be looking at imshow, uh, which, is, which is a function that displays data as an image uh, on a 2D uh, regular raster. So this is what we'll use to display a heat map. Uh, so first we'll go over some code I have uh, saved in Kaggle. Uh, so I'll briefly go over this code snippet and uh, by the end of it, it should generate a heat map. Uh, so over here, we are importing some libraries, uh, numpy, matplotlib, uh, pyplot submodule as plot. And then over here is our example. So for this example, I will be using uh, NHL theme and we're gonna have teams and we're gonna have team stats by year. So we have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven uh, teams and then uh, seven years uh, for these teams. And then in this NumPy array, we have a 2D array that represents all the years or, or all the games that the team won, that each team won by year. Uh, so if you can imagine um, the Bruins uh, representing the first column, then this would represent 2022 wins, 2021 wins, 2020 wins, 2020, 2019 wins uh, for the Boston Bruins. So that's what this RA represents. So this is what we will represent in our heat map. Uh, next, we're going to use, uh, we're going to create the uh, figure and subplots needed to display the heat map. And that's done using uh, the subplots uh, method uh, from matplotlib. Uh, also, the imshow method uh, or the function will be used to display the, uh, the games one array as a heat map. So we're just loading it. Uh, into this uh, uh, plot and next we have uh, we add the ticker uh, the ticks and labels for our heat map uh, so in the X direction we have the the um, labels of the length of the team or uh, the label would be uh, NHL teams which would be these and then on the y-axis we have uh, the team stats which would be by year yeah and then we are also going to rotate the tick labels and set their alignment so this is done uh, in order to make it more readable in case you have uh, column values that are running into each other by rotating them at a 45 degree, degree angle, you create more space and increase the readability. Uh, and then next we have a loop to uh, go over the uh, values contained in the NumPy, uh, in the, uh, NumPy array. Uh, so we use a double for loop and the AX uh, tax method to insert the value, let's say 91 to a corresponding uh, value in this plot that we're developing. Uh, so once that for loop is done, uh, we are, so in here we're specifying a number of things. So we're specifying 
uh, the row and column value through J and I then we specify which coordinate or value we're going to or element we're going to pick from the 2d array then we set the horizontal and vertical axis to center to make it centered and the color should be W uh, next we go over the title so we set the title to NHL games one by year and uh, we adjust the padding between and around the subplot using figure tight layout and then finally we call P, uh, plot show to display the generated figure so let's run this uh, code snippet and see what it generates um, yeah so just bear with me as this loads and while it's loading uh, just for clarification so a figure I'm gonna go over some definitions a figure in matplotlib is the most basic foundation for plotting data using matplotlib a subplot uh, is a smaller chart uh, yeah uh, a subplot is a smaller chart that is nested within a matplotlib figure and ticks are basically a series of values either in the x or y axis showing the coordinates on the graph uh, so here you can see the generated heat map and you can see over here that since we specified the color schema to W this is what's generated uh, so the lower the value is the more purple the value gets and the higher the value is the more green the value gets so this va uh, this color schema can most likely be improved to be more of a you know red green dynamic color value to make it more clear or more intuitive for the human eye but uh, yeah so this is the heat map that's generated and you will notice that in the x-axis these labels are uh, tilted in a 45 degree angle uh, due to this code uh, line so anyways that's the point of this tutorial I hope this was helpful if you found this video helpful, uh, feel free to like or subscribe to my YouTube channel. Uh, that's all, and I'll see you in the next video. Thank you.